It's got a snake. Hello, hey. Listen, I'm a mommy of three, so I always have something on me. It's crazy. And I just noticed that. And I've been out and about. Anyway, today we have a mini unboxing, unbagging. I ordered some fragrances to sample from Lulu. Um, her channel is Lulu's World. And I just wanted to open them, up, open them up and test them out with you. I really done forgot what I asked her for. So <clears throat> we're just going to have to... Go to Fragrantica as I look at it and, and remember what I ordered. Um, so if you're interested in that, keep on watching. And we're just going to get in right into it. So. Okay. So. This, I did not order all. I did not order all of this. Hold on. Stop. Girl, what? Hold on, guys. I did not order all of this. Lulu. Lulu. <laughs> okay, so what did I order? So I think I ordered these three. So I ordered, I, I believe, what am I looking at? Hold on. So I think I ordered these three from her. These are cute. Look at this. Oh, oh look at this juice. What is this? Oh, you're laying in gold. Oh, hold on. Do you guys see this? creamy glittery gorgeousness i like these i need to buy these yeah i definitely got this one i like this this is bougie yeah i got this one too yeah so i think i ordered these three and then she went and gave me some extra samples oh my goodness okay that's so nice of her oh my gosh okay boom don't drop anything so let's do what Look at these little shampoos! Yay! Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Guys, I feel like I just need to change my shirt. I can't funk it right, function right now. All right. It's like hot. I'm just, I can't. I mean, I have the AC going, but I just came from outside and it's booming out there. It's giving too much. So let's do this one first. This is Ajma Oram Summer. If I'm saying that wrong, I tried. So this is... Fruity, fresh, citrus, sweet, powdery, musky, woody, floral, and rose. I'm going to spray these one time because. Okay, there we go. Because <laughs> I want to try these on my skin. Okay, I have to spray one more time. I do smell it, but just, okay. Oh, yeah, there we go. Good spray, good spray. Two sprays. The bottle is cute. This is very fruity. Red fruits, apple, pear, bergamot, mandarin, orange. Oh, this is nice. Middle notes of peony, rose, osmanthus, orange blossom, and jasmine, and base notes of musk, vanilla, sandalwood, cedar, and moss. This is very nice. I, I love this bottle. It's definitely very tangy. The fruits in here is very fruity. This is very, oh. I feel like I almost smell the musk already. This is nice. It's definitely very fruity and stuff, but don't think like super fresh. There's definitely something strong in here. Um, I wanted to test this out. It is quite affordable on Fragrance Net. Fragrance Net, you can get, this is nice. I like this. I think I'm gonna order this now. You can get um, their 2.5 uh, ounce of this for 38 bucks. This is nice. I like this one. This one I fit um by. This is very lovely. And the bottle is bottling. I'm gonna put the bottle picture up here of it. Definitely a little powdery as well. So I'm gonna keep testing this out before I just go ahead and order it because I do have a, a decent amount of juice. This is definitely a solid three wears for me for sure. Oh my gosh, everybody has this one. And I was gonna just buy it. I think it's about like 50 or 60 bucks on um, Fragrance Net. And this is Nina Ricci's Chant de Extase. 
Now this is sweet, marine, caramel, aromatic, fruity, vanilla, citrus, musky, salty, and rose. And if you have been on this channel for any more than two, one or two videos, you already know I love me a salty sweet fragrance. Um, and I have one of me in Richie's fragrances already. I love it. Top notes of raspberry, ginger, lemon, pink pepper. This is going to be a slight, a little bit of a spicy opening. Middle notes of sea notes rose jasmine and magnolia base notes of caramel vanilla musk and ambergris so they sounded interesting to me because you got two types of as i spit everywhere oh two types of salt here you have the sea notes which is like an aquatic salty and then you have ambergris which is kind of salty a little bit to me um then you got spicy notes you got some white florals in here but the white florals are not by themselves so i don't think two this is very fresh sweet opening like a fruity it's not bubbling or spicy like i thought it was gonna be i'm gonna spray this right here this is very nice actually why did i say actually i figured i was gonna like it 47 bucks on fragrance net oh oh no it's bubbling in my nose on my skin Oh, this is lovely and this is working very well with what I'm wearing today so my scent of the day is um, beach nights lotion from Bath and Body Works no it's not mine this is working very well with what I'm wearing right now which is a salty sweet type of lotion and then I went ahead and put on um, dossier's dupe for uh, vanilla vibes which is called aquatic vanilla and then I topped it off with uh ocean jojoa by Giorgio armani um and knowing anything about those fragrances that's salty sweet the Giorgio armani i think has pear in it so it's it's not like a super sweet one but it's a salty semi-sweet fresh aquatic type of fragrance and then aquatic vanilla is aquatic but it's sweet and salty and this is sweet and no it's a caramel in here for me with this saltiness i really like this I might just go ahead and order this. So technically, I put myself on a one more buy, one more fragrance buy for this month. Um, one more fragrance being one more bottle fragrance. And then I'd have to get just decants or travel sprays of whatever. I might just let that go for this one particular fragrance because it's really not that expensive. It smells really good on my skin the caramel is coming through already this is very nice not the nose behind this fragrance is france curve de jean yo let me just take your nose because the way you're just magical is crazy this smells really nice to me i really like this um so i really wanted to try this ylang in gold by m mika left and i love the juice in this bottle this is buckling. I'm just going to put this onto my skin. Sweet vanilla, fruity, yellow floral, coconut, woody, powdery, aromatic, tropical, and lactonic. This is bubbling in my nose a little bit. What's in here? Fruity notes, peach, lychee, sage tangerine rosemary artemisia geranium bitter orange middle notes of yang lang ylang sandalwood mint magnolia rose lily of the valley base notes vanille coconut musk oak musk why you buy a you put notes in there something in here is going a little it's giving lotion right now it's giving lotion vibes i don't hate it but i'm not obsessed with it right now yelling and gold is a very popular fragrance so i wanted to try it out but because it's not very cheap it's definitely creamy it's giving like a lotion and i'm definitely got a glitter right there on me now that one it might just not be mixing well with what i'm wearing Now it smells like, I don't know how I feel about Yelling Gold. Let's come back to that one. Now, I'm about to order in like a month or so. Um, 
uh, dupe for Nishane Ani and she gave me a little bit of Nishane 100 Silent Ways. I'm gonna assume this is, hold on. I'm scared to even spray this on this card because I wanna put it on my skin. That's it. Calm down. Guys, the way I'm scared. Oh, there we go. One more spray. Come on. Yes! Wow, this is a thicker fragrance, it looks like. Hmm. Oh, this is on the straight. That's why it's a little on the thicker side. This is nice. White floral, vanilla powdery, woody, tuberose, fruity, sweet, iris, animalic, citrus. It's not as booming as I thought it was going to be. I also only put a little spray on here because I want to put this on my body at some point. Tuberose, peach, mandarin, orange. Gardenia, jasmine, and orris. And base notes of vanilla, sandalwood, and vetiver. I like this. Oh, maybe Joma Shop. I, who, who shops at Joma Shop? Let me know if you, that's a good place to shop at because they got something for 90 bucks from there. Let's see what's in here. They have a 1.7 fluid ounce, which is all I really need for 90 bucks. 60% off or 59. This is nice. I can definitely smell the tuberos. It's not obnoxious like in my way, but I can definitely smell it. So I got one wear out of this. I'm not just going to try to bathe right here in that little bit so I can really get it in my nose and see if I like it like it like it because 90 bucks really isn't bad this is very nice though but i definitely smell the tubero it's not like super bubble gummy but there's the tubero is, is, is this is nice i like this i like this next is al hermain's oi what is this i don't think i've ever heard of this Oi-uni? Oi-uni? Oi. Oi. <laughs> O-Y-U-N-Y. How do you say that? Not genie in a bottle. What is this I'm looking at? Sweet, fruity, warm, spicy. Powdery, vanilla, floral, tropical, yellow, floral, fresh, spicy, and musky. This is an affordable one. You can get this for $28 on fragrance that. Alhar Main's pricing is pretty good. Okay, so here's my situation with pineapple. I like this. But pineapple in my nose as a fragrance, I like pineapple itself, but pineapple as a, a fragrance note can sometimes be weird. But this is, smells nice. I'm gonna try this out. I did get a good, she gave me a good amount of little juice on here. So I can test this out. Definitely one solid strong or two reasonable amount of sprays, um, two separate times. Pineapple, rose, and bergamot, middle notes of peach, freezer, apple, base notes of sweet notes, tobacco, and patchouli. Oh, there goes some of the patchouli. This is nice, tobacco. I like it. And for $30? I think this is nice. I don't know. I definitely wouldn't wear this now. Next one is Nobile 1942 Per Design. Guys, you know I did my best. I did my best. This is not anywhere to be found to be bought on fragrantica but citrus white floral this bottle looks cool though vanilla sweet aromatic fresh spicy woody yellow floral powdery lavender this sounds like something i would like not neroli i let's try because i do have <coughs> whoa it's strong it's booming in my nose and i have it bent down on close to the floor Bomba. This must be an expensive fragrance because the way this is blooming in my nose and I'm not even me. 139? That is not even that expense. This is booming in my nose right now. My hand is over here. That's wild for me. 
The Neroli is very strong in this fragrance. This is definitely not a warm weather fragrance, so I'm gonna let this chill in my decant bot that um what is this called? Draw? I'ma let my the drawer drawer <laughs> this chill in there until it gets cooler. The neroli is very strong in here. I think I smell that orange blossom. What is pet what is Pate Grand supposed to smell like? I like this. I think. It almost smells like there's orange in here, but maybe that's that grapefruit. This is booming. This is booming. No, no. when I say it's booming, it's booming in my face. I like this a lot. This is exceptionally delicious. Guys, um... My lips are giving crusty dusty, and I don't have any on it right in front of me. I'll retry this again. That was um, Nobile 1942 per design. Listen, I'm probably saying it wrong, but I did my best. Next one, I just feel like I'm getting spoiled today. Serge Luton. Oh my gosh, I want to try Serge Luton. The like the brand. Um, this is the Tora Noir. Oh boy, I'm scared. Not the Tora. Is the Tora? Um, oh, not it popping up immediately. I said I was scared, but there's an almond in here. Vanilla, tuberose, white floral, sweet, fruity, coconut, powdery, floral, and nutty. No. No. Not $170 for a 1.6 bomba. Fragrance Net got, this must be a decant for $20. And then what's the next pricing? Let's see. Fragrance Net has it for, yes, you can get a 0.27 travel spray for $28. 1.6 fluid ounce for 121. If I like this, I like this. I like this. For some reason, it's giving a little bit mature, though. So I don't think my husband's going to like this. It's definitely different. There's something in here, which is probably the freaking tuberose. That's turning me off a little bit. I feel like I can... Guys, this is not bad. Oh, no, there goes the... Oh, my gosh. I just smell almonds and powderiness almost giving me like suntan like beachy suntany lotion vibes i like it it definitely smells a little grown though i'm trying to think if my husband would like this i don't think he would this is definitely not gourmand when i was reading the notes i thought this was going to be gourmand it's not it's definitely like a powdery sweet almond tuberose fragrance i got a good amount of juice to try to get one solid bomb bomb wear so i'm gonna try this one very soon sorry to try this i'm gonna try this one very soon this is nice and that was search with to the tota noir last one is pearlescence midnight jasmine oh this one sounds like it might be nice Midnight Jasmine. Oh, this bottle is cute too. It's fruity, sweet, white floral, amber, warm, spicy, rose, floral, cinnamon, honey, woody. I like this already. Tee -hee -hee. There's a note. I was like, fragrant, fragrant. Okay, come on. Jasmine Sandbag. Plum. Dried Apple Crisp. Brown sugar, Turkish rose, cinnamon, tonka bean, honey, Australian sandalwood, and amber. No. 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 Lulu. Miss Lulu. No. 
and there's nowhere for me to buy this. There's nowhere for it. It literally smells like apple cinnamon. It's not hot. It doesn't smell baked. Oh, it's honey. No. Oh, no. Where can I buy this? Not it's a... You only smell floral notes on this? This is apple cinnamon. It's gourmand, but not heavy. I would mix this with Scandal if I wanted to make this a nighttime fragrance. At least right now, it's not super booming in my... Like, it's, it's strong, but it's not super deep. This is very pretty. This is giving me along the lines of Scandal. Doesn't smell at all the same, but the honey in here. This is lovely. And this thing looked like it's nowhere to be found. It says Floral Fruity Gourmand. Oh, this was just launched in 2021. Mr. Gallagher, you did a little ting on ting on ting. I like this. And there's nowhere to find this. This is lovely. Oh my gosh. This is nice. This is big nice. This is this is tall nice. This is long nice. This is pretty nice. This is gourmand, but not. It's gourmand, but it's not like a super gourmand. What did they call this? Jasmine? Midnight Jasmine. This is nice. And watch, I don't find this anywhere anywhere mm, this is very nice here we go here we go here we go here we go hold on Bumba. not 175 you have a smaller bottle no This might have to go on my wish list. This is nice. This is very, very nice. Okay, so that is all I have for you. I'm really loving the Chant de Extas. I'm liking the Ozma Arum Summer. Oh, mm. the Galangian Gold has turned really nice. I think I, I really like 100 Silent Ways. Midnight Jasmine, and I think I like the, the Tour Noir, the Yelena Gold, Per Design, and are you guys? I'm really trying here, okay? Are up for re smells. Yelena Gold is smelling quite nice right now, so we're gonna go back to this and you know, I'll try it, I'll try it, try it, try it for a for all. Um, anyway, let me know if you tried any of these fragrances. Um, what you think of them do you think they're full bottle worthy or not uh do you already have a full bottle of some of these thank you so much for reaching the end of this video if you got to the end of this video go ahead and drop me a white floral um yeah just drop me a white floral and hopefully i'll see you in my next video bye bye